everybody. So today I'm going to talk about my business a little more in depth. Now I know I had done a video about like some tips and tricks if you have a small business, but I'm also going to, I'm going to give some advice, but I'm also going to talk about like how, why I wanted to start doing my Sensi business. So First, before I get into it, I wanted to say that, like I had said yesterday, I'm going to do a video every day for the whole month of March. Or I'm going to try to. I, if I miss a day, don't don't hold me to it. I just, I'm gonna try. Okay, so be sure that you comment, like, subscribe if you haven't already, and be sure to grab a snack or a cup of tea or whatever because this video might be a little long. Okay. So where to start? I guess I'm going to start with talking about how, how I wanted to, how I like, what made me want to start this business. So before I go into it, I just wanted to say that my link will be down below and I'm going to put the link to a party. Now I'm going to explain what that is in a little bit, but basically it's where if you use that link to shop as opposed to just going on my website, well you could do either way works. But if you use the link that I'm going to give you in the description box to shop, you can help me earn some rewards. I can get half price or free items. Um, and if I get $200 in, in sales just from the party, I will get, um, I can get rewards. So the way I wanted to start this business was I've been into fragrances. Now, for any of you who go, who have been on my website, if any of you have checked it out, you're gonna see that I have put a whole story up there about myself, and it's gonna tell you a little bit about how I got into it and you know some of my hobbies and stuff. So the way it started was that I got into wax melts last year, and obviously I asked around about who makes them, and people would tell me like Scentsy or like you can get them on. Amazon or Walmart or Target or whatever. So for a while, like obviously I was getting them on Amazon. And then I would say in about, I would say, I don't remember what made me start ordering stuff, but back in November, um, I found out that a girl that I know, and I don't know her personally, but the blind community, um, you know, I have a lot of blind friends. We all kind of do in the blind community. We don't all know each other in person, but we talk, if that makes sense. So we're friends, but we don't know each other personally, but we still talk to each other and, you know, exchange numbers and stuff like that. So I found out that this girl sells Scentsy products. And at first, I thought that she makes Scentsy melts. And I was like, she makes them? Like, I was thinking about doing that, but... I don't, I didn't want to actually make them. So I was told that no, she just sells them. So I went and I messaged this girl and I asked her what this was all about. And she told me, you know, like she said, oh, I friend you, I'll friend you on Facebook. You can come find, you can come, you know, whenever you want. You could have a Facebook party, which is what I was explaining about the other day or before. <laughs> um, you could have a party. So I was like, okay, that's, that sounds great. So I did have a party and I actually ordered stuff from my party because that was around Christmas time. So I, like I said, I was thinking about it, but never really actually did it. So then I decided after the new year, I decided that I really wanted to do it. So I was putting stuff about it on Twitter and this other lady who I had, I didn't even know who she was or anything like that. Um, but she, don't worry, she's not like, she's like really nice, but she found my tweets and she had basically said like, oh, you know, how would you feel if you can get, if you were able to get things that are half price or free, um, would you want to be able to, wouldn't you like to be able to smell all your, your scents before actually purchasing them? And I was like, yeah, that would be great. So she told me about how you got like a starter kit and, and how to, how to sign up. And she actually helped me sign up. So we were basically talking back and forth. She sent me a link. Um, I actually emailed it to myself so I wouldn't lose it because she sent it to me over Twitter. So I decided, you know what, I'll sign up. 
So I'm probably leaving a lot of out, a lot of information out, but it's only because I just, I might not remember everything, but basically that lady who told me about how she was a sensory consultant back in November, like I would order from her because I wasn't a consultant yet. So I was ordering from other people because when you're a consultant, you should order from yourself, from yourself, which I'll talk about that in a, in a minute. But I was ordering from her and she was like, oh, you know, you're, you're wonderful. You just, I just got email that you ordered from me this morning. And I told her I'd be keeping her in business. <laughs> but anyway, um, yeah, so that was basically how it all started. Just like from me ordering from her and I was interested in doing it. And I was seeing like, because as a consultant, you have to, you know, promote the products. So I was posting pictures on social media and so was she. So I was seeing all her pictures and it made me want all this stuff. So I was like, so I wanted to be, be a consultant. So basically that was how it all started. So like I said, getting back to me and this other lady. Um, so we were talking back and forth. We were messaging on Twitter. Um, she sent me a link. I went on and I became a consultant. Um, so joining was a pain in the neck. It was, I had a hard time with the accessing the whole join site. Like I said, it was a pain in the butt. She actually helped me join. Now, I trusted her, so I did give her like my personal information, and we did it over the phone. And I became a Sensi consultant on February the 7th. So basically now I'm going to talk about like how it's been going plus like some tips and advice for you guys. So it's been going really well. I've been doing a lot of promoting of products over on Facebook and Twitter. And I've also been um, telling my family about it. I was, I've been sending messages to people on Facebook. Um, I've had... My mom brings some catalogs to work. I've had, um, I'm going to bring some, I'm going out tomorrow, I'm going to bring some. So basically, um, once I got my kit was when I started like sharing my catalogs and stuff. So I got three sales so far. Now I ordered from myself, which I'm going to explain that in a second, but I don't count that as a customer obviously, but I have three customers, three people who I other other people who actually ordered stuff from me. Um, now, I it's been going well. I actually have to have. Okay, so for example, I'm gonna so let's see how I can explain this. So, I joined in February. Four months from February is June. Within a four month period, within that period from February until June, at least one of those months, I have to have. $200 or more in PRV, which is personal retail value, in order to stay active. And that's basically how much people spend when they order. And like it adds that up. So that's how much I have to have in order to stay active. If, say, four months goes by and neither of those months, and all, during all those four months, I don't have $200 in PRV, well, then I become inactive and I get unenrolled. So basically, I would have to enroll all over again, which is not something that I want. So that's why I have to really promote this. So now I'm going to talk about some of my tips and tricks for you guys. So my first tip would be when you get your catalog. So your catalog, you get, you get order forms. Now, people don't need the order forms like you don't really need them because people can just go on your website and order um but you know you have them just in case like you want to write down what somebody wants to order or something so you don't have to remember or maybe if you're placing an order for someone so you don't have to um you don't have to like remember what they wanted um so you're gonna get order forms but you don't necessarily need them you're also going to get catalogs um you're going to get now if I joined in February when they had the big sale for 10% off of all the fall and winter scents. So in August is when 
the summer and spring scents go on sale and the fall stuff comes out again in September. So since I joined in February, I got the catalogs and fragrance testers, and I'll go into what those are in a minute, but fragrance testers, I got all that for both seasons. That's the good thing about joining in February. So also joining was only $49. Um, there was also a $99 star starter kit, but I really didn't need that because you get more stuff. But I, I don't know. I just felt that I didn't really need that. But anyway, so once you get your kit, you're going to get you're going to get catalogs. You're going to get brochures. You're going to get sheets to give out. You're going to get some books for yourself. You're going to get fragrance testers. Now, what the fragrance testers are, they're these little containers, and inside the container is some wax. So basically, you just open it up and you smell them. And so that way people, let's say you're, you see, you're with people in person and you're, you know, you have people over your house, you have guests over or something, you can bring out those fragrance testers and people could smell them and they could, you know, all the scents that, that are, um, in those, that are, that they have in those fragrance testers that you have are all the scents that are in the catalogs. So you can give them to your guests and maybe they could like smell it and they could be like, oh, I like this one or I like this one, something like that. So also, so that's one thing that you want to make sure that you, you know, that you, you let your guests like smell all your fragrance, your fragrance testers. Um, once you get your kit, you also want to share your catalogs. Make sure you label everything you're giving out, catalogs, brochures, sheets, so that way people are interested, that way they know where to go to order. Because they're not going to be labeled for you because when they're being shipped out, nobody they don't know your website name. If you can't label them for some reason, you either have somebody do it for you or you can get labels. You can order labels. So also before your kit comes, you can even go on the website. Um, you could even like tell people about your website and start promoting stuff. Also, um, link your social media your Facebook, um, link all your social media, um, share stuff on social media, share pictures of products, share links to products on, on your social media, your Facebook, your Twitter, um, even your YouTube channel if you have it. If anybody says on social media, oh, does anybody have a small business? Put your link there. Um, also, if some time goes by and you don't feel like you're getting customers, don't be discouraged because you will. You will get customers. Maybe not so much in the beginning because you're new, you're promoting your business, but eventually those orders are going to come pouring in. So another mistake that I made now, it doesn't really matter, but like you should order from yourself because... You're essentially getting yourself discounts and stuff. Now, I looked at it as that, like, you're just giving yourself money. But you're essentially giving yourself discounts. So, and your help, it's helping you earn more money. So, what I did is I wanted to order stuff, which is fine. But I ordered from, now you need a sponsor. So, also, that's another tip I have for you. Connect with your sponsor if you have any questions. Ask your sponsor. So, I ordered something from my sponsor. And this lady asked me, she said, and she was the one who helped me sign up. She said, why did you order from me? You know, you should be ordering from, from yourself, taking advantage of the fact that you're a consultant. And at first I was kind of like, well, you know, I just like to kind of just, I like to support other consultants and stuff. And she just said, no, I would like, I want you to take advantage of the fact that you're a consultant. You can get discounts and stuff. So I was like, yeah, I can understand that. And at first I was going to ask her to cancel the order or to see if she could contact customer service and cancel the order. So she said she would see what they can do. And then a little while later, I told her to just leave it. And she said, are you sure? It's up to you. I'm like, yeah, it's fine. I'll just, I'll just, I'll just know for next time. 
to order for myself. I won't make that mistake. So what she actually did, because the real reason I didn't want to cancel it was because I didn't want to go through picking up, picking out all that stuff all over again, because it was quite a, quite a bit of stuff that I got. So um, what she did was she contacted customer service and she had them move the order to my account. So it was, so I got more PRV. Um, so that's another thing too. Order, if order from yourself. I mean, if you want, you can order from other consultants, but I encourage you to order from yourself. Um, now I can only speak for like Sensi business. I can't speak for anybody, any other kind of business that you guys may have. Um, also let's see. Um, I'm a part of a Facebook group called, um, so, well, I can't really say the name of the group because I don't know, because I can't just have like random people like coming in, adding themselves to it. But I'm a part of a Facebook group that my sponsor had created. And then she has two other people who are the administrators. So there's three admins to the group. My sponsor, the lady who's her sponsor, and then someone else. So basically we talk about all things sensey in that group. So maybe if you guys want to create a Facebook group and invite your team members. You can you can do that too. Um, also, the only people that can be added to the group are people who joined on our team. So somebody who joined under me, somebody who joined under my sponsor, those are the only people who we can add, but we can't just add other people. Like I had a, I have a friend who just joined and she signed up under the lady that I initially ordered from like who I found out was a consultant I asked my sponsor if I could add her to the group this friend of mine and she said no well first she asked me if if this lady had signed up under my team and I said no she did not she signed up under somebody else who I know though and she said no we, it's it's only the group is really only for our team because we have like team incentives and stuff so I, I was like okay I understand that so I didn't add her to the group so have like groups on your social media where you could talk about stuff. Um, so let's see. I think that's about it. I just have to get more customers. Um, also, that's another tip I have for you guys. Wherever you guys go, whether it be the gym, the mall, go out to eat, just leave, just leave catalogs around. But make sure you label them because people see it and they're interested. They're not going to know where to order if you don't. So label them, just be like, here, you go here to order and then put the name of your website. So, yeah, but um, that's another, that's another piece of advice I have. Make sure that you, you bring your catalogs wherever you go. Even go on sites like Craigslist and put your business out there. Um, you know, email your friends and family and just give your link to everyone you know. You have to, like, you really got to promote this. So those are my tips and advice for you guys and basically just how I got started. So definitely feel free to comment down below if you have any questions. And like I said, my link will be in the description box below. And today is currently the first. So I'm recording this on the first, but you're going to see it tomorrow. So um, I'll leave my link down below and like I said before I'm going to leave a link for a party so that way if you guys decide to, sh to um, buy anything you're going to help me earn some rewards so it's a win-win you guys get your favorite scents and I get some rewards so because it can't be just me buying stuff I gotta I need other customers as well so I'm gonna let you guys go be sure to comment like subscribe if you haven't already and I will talk to you guys tomorrow for another video because by the time you see this it will be March 2nd so